Good afternoon. We are tracking a few rain showers and snow showers just north of our area here across Ashtabula, Lake County. These will descend southward and move into Trumbull and Mercer and probably at least isolated chances across Mahoning, Columbia, and Lawrence County as well. This is all with a little trough of low pressure here that's going to move southward and it's going to help that band of rain and snow coming off the lakes move into our area. All these clouds though, unfortunately, those are going to be sticking around through the day to the rest of today, today and into tomorrow as well. Currently 38 degrees. It's a little bit windy as well. Southwest winds at 15 miles per hour. So it's definitely chilly. 38 in Youngstown, a little bit about the same. 38 Worcester, 40 in Cleveland, and it's currently 39 degrees in Pittsburgh. But when you factor in that wind of about 10, 15 miles per hour in spots across most of the area, it feels like it's in the upper 20s to lower 30s, below freezing wherever you go. So you might want to have the gloves handy, the hats handy, and those winter coats for whenever you go out this afternoon. As we look ahead and plan your day throughout the afternoon, an isolated rain or snow shower becomes possible after about 2 p.m. We hit our high temperature at 39. There by 8 p.m. those are uh, snow showers possible and a little bit of drizzle at 35 degrees. And we will track this all for you here with Future Tracker. And meteorologist Matt Jones is going to be in this evening to look at all the weather that's moving through as well and keep you updated. A few rain showers, snow showers. You can see the pink. That's that mix between rain and snow as we go through your afternoon and evening commute. Then a few snow showers by 8 p.m. These are going to mainly be light, but you could see a little slushy coating, especially in the higher ground of Mercer and Trumbull County. Clouds stick around. So do the middle 30s as we go into the morning hours tomorrow. We should really knock away any of the rain or snow chances and notice a few breaks in the cloud cover through the day tomorrow. So that'll be good news. And then we go through the day Sunday and we'll be mainly dry. Temperatures of a degree or two warmer. We should hit about 40 degrees eventually. And then notice off towards the west, here comes a little system that's going to be a rain snow mix. Some of you will see snow from that, but we're not talking much at all as we go through Sunday evening into the overnight hours. How much snow? Well, let's detail it out for you. This is about all I expect tonight in some spots maybe upwards of a quarter of an inch in a few spots. And then as we go through the time on Sunday with that next system moving through, it's really not going to add much to the totals at all. We're talking just maybe a coating to a quarter of an inch or so. Let's look at that seven day forecast now, shall we? 40% chance there on Sunday of that rain and snow. 42 partly sunny for Monday. Our next good chance of rain arrives Tuesday, but we'll be a little warmer in the middle 40s. Then a big old system comes crashing through on Thursday, bringing rain to snow and a chance for lake effect snow. Only middle 20s by Friday.